All right, we're going to answer part C of example one now. And part C just says, who is the better batsman and why? So when we look at Ben and Adam, both Ben and Adam have the same mean and median. And median. Which basically means that the measure of center, or the central measure, really can't be used to decide who is better. However, Adam had a smaller interquartile range and standard deviation. Which implies that his scores are grouped close together. Now what does that mean? Why is that good? What it means is he's a more consistent batsman. Most of his scores are around about the same mark. Just look at it. Most of his scores are around the late 20s to 30s, early 40s. So therefore, he is the better batsman since the scores are more consistent.